Hi, I'm Alan Buell from the National Slate Association. In this segment, we'll be talking about basic concepts for laying out a slate roof. Roof layout is critical to the roof's appearance, performance, and efficient installation. Factors to consider before starting the layout plan are the size of the slate being installed, slate pattern, overhang on the even gable, and the recommended exposure and headlap based on the slate size and roof slope. The first step is to determine if the eave is straight and level. This can be done by attaching a taut line along the eave from end to end to check for straightness and undulations. Next, measure and determine that the gables or end walls are squared to the eaves. Now, locate the line for the starter course considering the overhang and the line for the first full course, which will have its butt end on the lower edge of the starter course. Using the 3-4-5 method can be helpful when establishing this square line. Also, check if the ridge is parallel to the eave. Then mark and snap multiple lines using the exposure measurement. Two vertical lines can then be laid out with one line being half the width of the field slate. Be sure to plan the location of these lines and consider the finished size of all the gable or wall slate is within reasonable standards. Always plan your approach to walls, gables, ridges, so several small adjustments can be made instead of one or two large adjustments. I hope this has helped you understand the basics of slate roof layout.